Ooh, first time going live on my cell phone. Ain't that something? Bang. See who, uh, see who pops in here. What up, what up? Happy birthday, Webb. Kev, what up, boy? Man, I'm in, I'm, I'm in a world of hurt right now, you guys. Family's out of town, so I decided, hey, what up, boy? Family's out of town, so I decided I was going to do some card sorting. So, and next thing you know, and I promise you, this isn't even close to all my cards. Not even close. Oh, Lord. Yeah. Good time. So decided I'm going to be putting stuff in different boxes. Um, fun times. Try to have a little better organization. A little better, better organization. Anyone getting lag? Uh-oh, is it lagging? That sucks. My first time trying to go live. I'm hooked up to Wi-Fi, so... You rebooted and it's all good. Well, remember when I was trying to go live from my cell phone before I had my computer a long time ago and it wasn't really working, so I had to switch my, I had to switch my service to that, uh, to that better service, and that was a hundred bucks a month. And then after I went back to using my computer, I couldn't go live anymore. Um, I dropped back to uh, my other plan, which is only twenty bucks a month. So. We shall see how it goes. Uh, yeah, figured if I was sorting, I'd go live, say what's up. Show some cards again. A bunch of these cards you guys have already seen a hundred bazillion times, but. Oh, it's your Jordan year, right? Hundred, hundred billions of times, but figured I'd uh, show them anyways while I'm putting them away. Got new boxes. Uh, to hold hard plastics and graded cards, uh, pretty dope. Yeah, I'm, I'm, Kev. I'm, I'm gonna be locked up, bro, guaranteed for the next few months. Uh, I, I have no idea what my schedule is gonna be. I gotta get myself established um, where I'm at, uh, and before I know it, it's gonna be winter and four feet of snow. It's probably gonna be a next summer thing, bro. To just to be honest with you. Um, I, I, I go in, start my training here on the 20th, uh, super excited for that, nervous, but excited. Oh, right, you got to move. I like this card right here. It's a pretty nice card. It's it's crazy. I guess I haven't had all my I haven't had all my vintage in the same place uh, in a while. Um, they've been in random different boxes. That's why I'm trying to do some organization. So I was really surprised at how many vintage cards and doubles <laughs> doubles I've now acquired of uh, my guys. That I'm trying to collect. So these are all mantles that I'm showing right now. Got mantle down there in the middle. Love the 58 mantle all star. Yeah, man. Here, you know what's crazy about that card? This is what's crazy about that card. <laughs> I love it too. <laughs> I I knew I had a couple of them because I you know I bought three of them at uh at National. Forgot I already had one. Forgot um, Crosby bought me one. <laughs> yeah. Hey, any of you guys in here that's not following Wax Pack Wax Pack Poetic Lou? Shoot him a uh, shoot him a holler. He does great videos. Um, 
just popping back in. Was an awesome guy. Got to have some drinks with him. That's a uh, this is a national one right here. Panini. Panini Eternal. I think they gave this away at the national. One of two hundred. <laughs> Posada, what up, boy? Oh, let me finish showing these uh, mantles, and then I'll go check, bro. Damn, I didn't realize I got any mantles. Another mantle down there. I think I already showed these ones. Okay, yeah, I did already show those. I am fucking going to show them again. Yeah. Good cards. Got two of those. You know I do the, the vintage for uh, for little Jimmy. So I'm constantly on the lookout for it. Oh, man, I'm with it. I, I don't even know how to do the, uh, where we could do a video together with me not not being there. So you're going to have to teach me. Like, I have, I have no idea. Well, here's some more mantles. One million dollars. Mantle up there. So my mantle, mantle collection. Oh, huh. Here's more. Mantle up there. Mantle collection is nice, man. I didn't I didn't realize that I had that many Mickey Mantles now. So Alright man, get to work, get to work. Was I that drunk? Yep. You bid one trillion dollars. Um and I guess we'll put, so we got Mantle in there. We'll go ahead and throw the Maris. I, man, I, I started collecting Maris first before Mantle. And I guess I kind of hopped off the Maris train. Wait, any other Mantles in here? What's the Maris? I guess I hopped off the, uh, oh, yeah, thanks, man. Yes, man, people made that happen for me. That was crazy. I had uh, Mike, baseball, baseball uh, collector. I uh, did a shout out video. Man, it almost got me like a hundred subs, like 70 subs or something in one day. It was crazy. And then uh, Tim A put something out to where when I hit a thousand, he'll give somebody 50 bucks for one of my auctions to spend. Um, and then Pepino Man put me over that, uh, put me over that hump and got me my final few. Um, it's crazy. Oh, Maris Rookie. Maris on now. Couple nice, couple nice little Maris cards here. Damn, you look old right there, boy. They did him dirty in that one. All right, bro, gotta start packing, loading. Oh man, we oh for moving. It sucks that the uh, the screen you gotta let it do it sideways. All right, man, have fun. That's a newer one. Like that one. What was that the rookie? I think this is the rookie. Fifty-eight. Oh, I'm tripping. Fifty-eight. Nah. Huh. Hey, what up? What up? Just uh, doing some. Organization while the family's out of town. Thought I'd uh, actually put all my stuff together. I had Mickey Mantles and random boxes all over the damn place. Um, got Maris on this one, bottom left. What she got on here? Killabrew, Norm Cash, Rocky. Nice cod, nice cod. Oh shit, got two more of those. We got five of those. Joker, what up? I already went through all those. Who should we do next? What what vintage star should we show next? Um how about Willie Mays? Let's 
Let's see what we got going on here. Well, I obviously love that card. It's crazy. One of them, for some reason, has a clipped corner. Oh, yeah, I got some Nolans. What else we got here? We got Willie with Stan. These are cool cards. These are like 1979. Some little randoms. Willie Mays on there. Tyler, what up? Yeah, I started, uh, my, my, my collecting goal was to, uh, who do I PC? My biggest PC is Jack Flaherty, pitcher for the Cardinals. Um, right? Can never have too many Willie Mays cards. Um, I collect vintage for my son. I love that card right there. That card's in beautiful condition. But somebody wrote. The, his stats on the back. I got a Hank Aaron like that too. Um, my my daughter collects Bo Jackson, Derek Carr. Got Maze in there. Got Frank. Who else? You got uh, Ernie Banks, Hank Aaron. A nice fucking card right there. Look at that man's forearms, and that's like at the end of his career. It was a beast. I don't know if you guys have ever done this before, but I love uh, going on YouTube. And, uh, man, it'd be awesome. I'd, I'd, I'd appreciate that. Shoot me, uh, shoot me an email. Uh, and I'll shoot you my address, man. All right, who should we do next? How about Jackie Robinson? Yeah, so um, I, I, you know, started collecting, and I wanted to, uh, I feel like I'm missing one of my Jackies. I am missing a Jackie. Um, I decided for my son, I wanted to collect vintage cards, and I wanted to hand him a damn near 100-year-old uh, collection, um, you know, when he was getting ready to go into college to do what he wanted uh, with it. So that's why I started collecting. Man, he's killing it. He's, a, he's the number two pitcher, uh, what, in the last month and a half? He's fucking... Whiffing people. What do you have? 32 hitless innings right now he's on? Too bad they lost last night. Some Jackie Robinsons. A little, little bit of Ted Williams, huh? I don't like Ted. Wasn't Ted Williams... Wasn't Ted Williams packing out... Uh, Marilyn Monroe? No, I'm thinking of the wrong guy. Ted was old as shit, huh? <laughs> yeah, I got some K-Lines. I got that, man. I got that one at the National. Oh, yeah, I, I already did uh, Mantles. I did that at the beginning. Got a good amount of Mantles, man. Yeah, after the video's over, go back go back to the beginning and I, I pop through all the mantles. <clears throat> Cowboy cards, what up? Yeah, man, I, I bought this card at the National. It was all ripped and dusted. Got it for five bucks. But I was like, man, I could have swore I already have that card, but it's not that card. It's It looks exactly the same almost, but it was a different one that I had. I just, I don't, I don't go through my, my vintage too often to really know what's what or what I got. All right, who we got now? Um, who we got? We got, uh, we'll do some, I'm going to some Killer Brew real quick. Couple Harmon Killer Brews. 
Carl Yass, Killer Brew, and Robinson. Got Reggie on this. It <laughs> could be. Depends on who submits it, right? Got the scratch off, Killer Brew. Uh, got two of his second year cards. And got the Killer Brew rookie. Beautiful card. Think about getting a locking box. No. Uh, it's a lot of money, but I probably should get something like that. How about some Warren Spines? Let's see what we got here with Spawn's goofy ass. Got a bunch of spawns. Card's in beautiful shape. Love that card. This is Milwaukee Braves. That's got some stain, some stainage, some water stain damage, but uh, still a beautiful card. Love it. Love that card. Guess I got another one of these. See another one of these with a clipped corner. I don't know, I don't know what the deal is with that. Uh, I think this card is really cool right here. Because on the bottom right here, somebody wrote my first baseball card. See that? My first baseball card. And I think that's really, really cool. That uh, from the mid-50s, I have somebody's very first card that they ever owned. I just I like I like little stuff like that. I'm a goofball. Those are those. And yeah, we only got a couple stand usuals. Yeah, Cueto. Man, uh, when that when this is done, go back and watch the whole thing. I'm I've actually got my, my vintage all in one spot. Um I got one one satchel page. Bobby, what up? Pick this up at the national. A few of you have seen that. Let's do some uh, let's do some Hank Aaron's. Love the guy. So yeah, on YouTube, you guys could go uh, on YouTube. I don't know if any of you ever have, but you could look up the old home run derbies. Um, they got ones with mantle and uh, mantle and maze. Love watching them, man. Seventy five mini. Be cool if you could somehow find them and show them. And say sight and kick them in the balls and run. <laughs> hey, I like your way of thinking though. You know, just try to he'll always remember that card and then he'll always remember our encounter when I roast Shambon. <laughs> Got another 75 mini and a regular. Got a good amount of Henry Aaron's. It's a nice card. Yeah, there's a lot of uh, a lot of different cards that are just, I mean, beautiful, beautiful cards. I mean, 60, 61, awesome. 75. I'm look old right there. Oh boy, look at him. He tired. 
Thanks, Bubba. Just, uh, I'm a cardaholic, right? Welcome, Michael. You won't be judged here, not in this room. I like that one, too. See, here's another one of those, like the maze. Just beautiful, beautiful condition, right? Centering's nice and everything. And the guy wrote the stats for the next year, his next year. And he had great penmanship, too. Um, stats for the next year on there. Like these, the little card games. I got the whole set of those. Scratch offs, not scratched. Looking old again. Hopefully, I'm not. Chaney, what up, boy? Hopefully, I'm not flipping through them too fast. You guys are able to catch them. I just there's there's a bunch. I'm not trying to sit here and keep you guys on forever. I still haven't made breakfast. I'm about to go cook a T-bone about that thick. Some eggs. Oh, what's up? What up? Yeah, just just running through some some vintage again. Oh, that one scratched. Like that, sixty nine. So there's the Hanks. Let's do some Clementes. Another the Hank on there with Clemente. The Hank on there with Clemente. Hank on there with Clemente. Sixty nine. Got maze on here. Oh yeah, Ricky, when the, when the video's done, go back and start it over. I started with the mantles. <laughs> what up, Pepino? I'm in trouble, Pepino. Look, I started organizing my cards. I brought them all out here. Brought my beer pile table out. And this isn't even, this isn't even all my cards. This is legit, like, it's legit like a fourth of my cards, man. I got issues. There's some Clementes. Ooh, do some, uh... Do some, some Babe Ruths real quick. I like all these cards are pretty cool. Got two of those. My Babe Ruth collection is kind of weak, but I do got the 1932 Sanella Babe Ruth. In fact, I got four of them. Yeah. 
who we got over here? Oh, one, one of my one of my guys right here. The Mad Dash. You know, Slada. Oh, blue bag. See, clip down at the bottom again. Got two of those. Let's break a couple Pete Rose cards, huh? I mean, nothing, nothing spectacular here. Um, you know, a bunch of Pete Rose newer stuff. Everybody's seen all that stuff. Everybody has a hundred thousand each of those. Mike Schmidt, right there. Yeah, I agree. Let Pete in. Nice sixty-nine, right there. I like that card. Just a bunch of randoms. There's nice decals. A couple ground out card games. <laughs> 20 cents. That's that's me. That's me when I start my auctions. That's what I see. And then that's that's what I see when I'm finished my auctions. I'm like, what the hell? Seventy five mini and regular. Couple of those got another mini right there. Uh, got another card game, and then got. It's got some nice, nice Pete Roses. Love me some Pete Rose. Uh, told the story before, but uh, what up, what up? Told the story before, but I was, I was such a fuck up growing up in middle school. I was in in-house detention. I used to have, my name used to be on a piece of tape on the back of a chair. I had my own seat in-house. And uh, my teacher, Mr. Dickinson, one day, he was like, Jimmy, man. Just make it one week without going to detention. And I got something special for you. And I, I tried, I worked real hard and I made it one week, some Ernie Banks. And he gave me the whole 1985 newspaper when Pete Rose broke Ty Cobb's record. Pete Rose Jr.? No. Got an extra 68 medal. Well, I got a few. Couple, couple of Nolan Ryan's. Nothing major. I need to, I need to step my Nolan Ryan game up for sure. Oh, he, he gave me the paper because I was good for a week. Um, so somewhere in my mom's house in the attic, somewhere. But I know I have it, but that's why I like uh, that's why I like Pete Rose so much. I just I just remember that. You know, I obviously never thought I was going to uh, <laughs> not go to detention for detention for a whole week. So How about some uh, Reggie Jacksons. Norm Cash on there with him. Same one.
watching the car. Congrats on it. Man, thank you so much for that. Like, the, the day you did that shout-out video, brother, I got, like, 70 subs that day alone. Um, crazy. And then Pepino Man threw me on a little one at the uh, his video, what was it, yesterday? Yeah, yesterday. And that just bumped me over. Um, but I really appreciate you guys. Uh, for doing that, you know, it's just one of those milestone things you want to get there You want to be able to go live like I'm live right now from my phone uh, I'm not in there on my uh, computer uh, Pretty cool But yeah, this this might be a video you might want to uh, watch from the beginning later Mike I was uh, going through and kind of reorganizing all my vintage and I just I just got a ton of stuff um, uh, like that, my Rizzutos, that was one of my first vintage cards, and that thing's just beat to shit. So, of course, I, I replaced it, but I'll keep that one. I like this one right here, the Rizzuto, Billy Martin. It's a nice card. Uh. Got some Brooks Robinson. I already did the Reggies. Uh, Carew. Yeah, I just got some random stuff right here. Looks like my Granny Hamner. Same year, also torched. Are your nipples pierced? No. <laughs> nope. They're not, you know. I ain't gonna lie, I had my eyebrow pierced. And I had my tongue pierced when I was younger. <laughs> Some Frank Robinson. Yeah, right? I plan to have a chain that runs from my nose ring to both nipples. All the way down to my whatever whatever they call that thing. The one that comes out with your weenus. The rolly fingers. Bunch of decals. I got just boxes of, of just random vintage. Drysdale. Uh, Pee Wee Reese. Got a little damage over here. Looks like someone's chewing on it. Oh, Dave Winfield. Not the oldest card, but. And I'll randomly have some shit like this in there. <laughs> like in Dale Murphy rookie just in this shit. Yogi clip bottom again. Weird. All right, you take care, Mike. Appreciate you, bro. I appreciate you. Got a Munson. Schneider. Oh, here we go. You know who we forgot about? We forgot about Sandy Koufax. How do we forget about Sandy Koufax? Ron Santo Cubs rookies. Eee, what year was he? I don't. Think so. All right, Chaney, take care, bro. Another one of those seventy nine cards. I got a maze like that. Sandy is dandy. I know you like the Kofax. A little Drysdale action on there. Pretty cool. That's cool. I got Sandy and Warren Spawn and Juan. Perry and Gibson on now. Cool stuff, man. Sandy, he's a mic got a little bit of room and fit. Alright. Uh, 61 is his rookie. I don't know. I mean, I, you know what? I, I... 
prices are high because I have an amazing amount of, of vintage. But uh, off the top, I don't know. Well, I've let my T-bone steak sit out for a while. Barbecue pro tip. When you're going to barbecue, leave, leave your meat out for an hour or two. Let it get room temperature. That way, when you cook it, you cook it rare. The inside is rare, not cold. Look at that. The T-bone just as beautiful as can be. I'm about to go throw this on the grill, cook up some eggs. Have some steak and eggs for breakfast. Starving. Um, I appreciate y'all rocking with me. Thank you, thank you. Be on the lookout for a big 1K uh, giveaway I'm going to be doing. That sounds like me and Pepino are going to do something together for his 1700. My 1K uh, should be something epic. Should be something huge. So, um, man, get the word out to your friends. Uh, let's get everybody in on this. Have some fun. Thanks for the vintage tour. Man, I appreciate you hanging out. If you guys missed any of it, go back, watch the beginning. There's some fire in here. Um, thank you guys all for helping me get to a thousand. That way I can go live. Good times. All right. You guys take care. How the fuck do I get out of here now? I don't even know how to end this on this phone. Just press X. Yep. All right. Later. <laughs>